Hello everyone, welcome you all. This is Suresh from SD Automation channel. Today in this session, I am going to discuss about the difference between regression testing and retesting. So let's get started. Regression testing is performed for past test cases, while the retesting is performed only for failed test cases. If you take an example of your application, you design the test cases based out of login and you do certain functionality, then you log out. So during all these phases, you design the test cases for each and every module and you put them into a suit, that suit called as regression testing. And you perform testing on your application and if all the test cases that you are designed are getting passed, then it is considered to be a regression suit. And during that testing, if any test case is getting failed and you mark them as failed and you perform testing again on that, so that is considered as retesting. Regression testing checks for unexpected side effects while the retesting makes sure that original fault has been corrected or not. So if I give an example of version 1 which is went to live environment and version 2 is getting ready for an update on the version 1. So you take both of them into one build or you test it with the both in integration and you perform testing and checks for any unexpected behavior into your application. And if you find any issue during your beta version, you log a defect and you again retest on those defects, make sure that that issue is fixed or not. And regression testing doesn't include defect verification. So you may be having confusion that Defect testing is also a part of regression testing. No, it's a part of retesting where you do a retest and if you perform regression testing on every defect verification, so regression testing is costlier than retesting because it exhausts all your resources doing a testing. Regression testing is known as generic testing, whereas retesting is planned testing. So what is the term generic testing? If you take an example of your project, whenever you designing a project, you will get a functionality or a requirement and you get a training out of all the requirements and you refer some reports, analytics and you design a proper test case suit. That suit is called as generic testing. So no matter what that you have to follow those test cases to ensure your application is eligible to go live and retesting is a planned testing. So whenever you are performing, you know, defined steps and what you wanted to achieve. Best example is a defect verification. So this is the difference between this step. And regression testing is possible with automation testing, whereas retesting is not possible. Why retesting is not possible because you are testing a particular test cases. But there is a possibility that if your automation suit having or storing some failed test cases, then you can rerun those. So best example is a test ng XML file that will rerun your failed test case only. So through automation, you can achieve it. But whenever you are testing a regression and you find one side effect which you have or which test case is not is a part of your regression testing but it is out of your exploratory testing then it should be a retesting and testing a regression is really a bit costlier than normal cases because it will exhaust your all your manual resources where resources are occupied doing a testing. So better you can go for automation and we have an approach to do a retest on a failure test cases. I have designed a session on that. So I will share that link in the description box. You can see how you can retest your failure test cases and interview also you can answer this type of question whether retesting is possible in the automation testing or not. Yes, you can say it is possible, but if it is failed as part, your, as part of your regression testing, then you can say it's possible. But if it is not under regression test cases, then it is not really a, or it is, it, it takes a time taking process to automate that or such cases. 
आई होप दिस सेशन इज़ हेल्पफुल फॉर यू थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग